After driving all the way from New Jersey to Halifax, Nova Scotia, I picked up Taylor and Wyatt at the airport and we headed east towards North Sydney, the location where the ferry takes off to Newfoundland. We found a nice little spot along the lake to sleep for the night and woke up early to ensure we had enough time to get to the ferry. Getting on the ferry is a seamless process and you can tell that it's a well-oiled operation. Hello, good morning. Uh, so we have Wyatt who's a little baby and uh, can we bring strollers onto the boat? Okay, there's plenty of like, there's no real restrictions with that or anything. Okay. There are two options to get to Newfoundland from Nova Scotia. North Sydney to Port of Bass and North Sydney to Argentia. Both routes are offered at different days and different times throughout the week, so go online to make your purchases and find the right ferry for you. We opted for the North Sydney to Port of Bass since it's shorter and we could do it during the day. They do offer cabins for an extra price, but you need to book those way in advance, especially for the overnight cruises. We got to the ferry about two hours before, lined up, and they packed us in like sardines. Okay, we are officially going to the main deck, which is cabin seven. Our vehicle is parked on deck three. You gotta remember which deck you park your car on. You don't wanna forget. The ferry itself is surprisingly comfortable. On deck seven, you have a cafe, a gift shop, restaurant, bar, lounge area, and a seating area. Deck 8 has cabins and more seating areas, which tends to be a bit quieter than Deck 7. And then Deck 9 has additional cabins and reserved seating area that you have to pay for up front. We hung out mainly in the bar lounge area since we were able to have a nice table right by the windows and we were able to get some work done. For food, we had the fish and chips, which were the worst fish and chips we've ever had. It's ironic because Newfoundland is known for the fish and chips, so we took a guess that it was gonna be great, which it absolutely is not. We also had the chicken burger, which was pretty good, and I would get that again. Overall, the ferry was pretty smooth, and we actually got to Port of Bass under seven hours, which was nice, and we were able to hit the road. You did so good on your first trip. All right, we are back in the van. We are 10 minutes away from our camp spot today and we are finally in Newfoundland. Newfoundland. 23 days late, but we still made it. Newfoundland, baby, let's go. Newfoundland, sorry. Are you so excited? Tell mom how excited you are. Our very first spot, there's a no camping sign. So we are on to the next one, which means Wyatt isn't getting out of the car seat a little earlier. Okay. Spot number one, pretty sweet. We are right by the water and we have a ProMaster to the left of us. And there's a beach not too far from here as well that we could walk to maybe in the morning. Unless mommy wants to go now, but it might be a little late. Well, we're scratching this spot because we found another no overnight parking camping spot so we're gonna respect the locals wishes and drive a little bit further we wouldn't really have a problem with that at all but every time we put Wyatt back in the car seat you know it's like kind of teasing him so we get him out and then we put him back in then we get him out we put him back in and he just wants to be out and play so we try not to drive very far and that's why we tried to find a spot very close to the ferry ow, ow, ow. so that's my hair off to the next spot, it's 20 minutes away, but I think it's gonna be worth it. We found our parking spot. You're dead. It's right along the water. It's nice. It's nice. It's flat. Our little boy's playing. Right and up. mom and dad are gonna try showering in the shower for the first time. Put it to use. Yeah, put our microwave to use too. True that, yeah.
What the heck? Don't let it leak on the bed. That's pretty brutal. I guess maybe because we had it sideways. I don't know. But sideways instead of one up and down. Vertically. But I thought you could do it horizontal. I'm pretty sure you can. So I don't know. We'll have to monitor the uh, shower. Why would that affect the shower? We have one on the show. I think we're good though. I'm ready for bed now. I got zero work done. Can I fix the problem and why it is still asleep? Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's lucky. Really lucky. Luckily, things get better for us here in Newfoundland as we head eastbound towards St. John's, Newfoundland's largest city on the island. In the next episode, we find the best fish and chips and explore the best things to do while there. We also make it to North America's most easterly point and find the coolest little coastal neighborhood.